to determine the mass percentage of water imbibed by raisins. Osmosis is a type of diffusion of solvent, usually water, from higher concentration to lower concentration through a semi-permeable membrane. Endosmosis is the inward movement of water when the surrounding solution is less concentrated. It leads to swelling and increase in volume. Exosmosis is the outward movement of water when the surrounding solution is more concentrated. It causes shrinkage. Starch is a naturally abundant storage form of carbohydrate in plants and animals. Ma'am, how can we determine the mass percentage of water imbibed by raisins? Imbibition is a phenomenon by which the living or dead plant cells absorb water by surface attraction. Substances that are made up of cellulose or proteins are hydrophilic, that is, have a strong affinity for water. They imbibe water or moisture and swell up. Example, dry seeds, wooden doors, etc. swell up on contact with water or on exposure to moist air. Due to imbibitional pressure, seed coat ruptures in case of germinating seeds. It is an important force in the ascent of sap. Let's do an experiment to determine the mass percentage of water imbibed by raisins. Our aim here is to determine the mass percentage of water imbibed by raisins. Materials required are raisins, kishmish, water, beaker, glass, petri dish, blotting paper, physical balance, weight box, Forceps. Procedure. Take about 25 dry and clean raisins. Weigh them with a the physical balance. Note their mass as M1. Put the raisins in a petri dish and add some water to it so that raisins are fully immersed. After 2-3 hours, raisins swell up. Remove the swollen raisins from petri dish and place them on a blotting paper for removing the excessive water sticking to their surface. Weigh the swollen raisins. Note their final mass as M2. Observations Due to imbibition, the movement of water takes place into the raisins. Thus, the raisins increase in size. Initial mass of 25 dry raisins W1 is equal to X gram Final mass of swollen raisins W2 is equal to X gram Mass of water absorbed by raisins W2 minus W1 is equal to X gram Mass percentage of water absorbed by raisins is equal to Mass of water absorbed by raisins upon initial mass of raisins multiplied by 100 is equal to W2 minus W1 upon W1 multiplied by 100 is equal to X percent. Result. The percentage of water absorbed by raisins is equal to X percent. Precautions. Take raisins that have intact stalks. Do not add excessive water, but the raisins should be completely immersed. Do not disturb the setup. Do not tightly pack the raisins. Gently dry out the water present on the outer surface of raisins by rolling these on a blotting paper before taking final observation. Record the weight accurately. Thank you, ma'am. This experiment has made the concept very easy to understand.